as mentioned in one of my little vids that I do here, um, the actual true birth date of Christ was actually September 11th. I figured that out through long, exhausting work, and then I was looking through my tablets, people. I was sitting there knowing that I see it, saw that number before. I saw it in Egyptian things or something. I was looking through, and yeah, I found it in the Egyptian things. But right whenever I saw it on the piece of paper and I looked at the word September 11th, whenever I saw it in the Egyptian stuff I had written, I realized in that one second there, all of a sudden, oh, September 11th. And then it just dawned on me. That's why they did the two pillars right there. That's why they killed the Asherah pillars on Christ's birthday. That's what that was about. This is the way the sky would be depicted at uh, Christ's birth. And you can see how the conjunctive planets come down through. And uh, Jupiter and uh, is in Virgo. And the sun and the moon are there. And it looks like she births the sun. And because it's over the, the actual constellation itself. So they say it's clothed in it or whatever. And um, it actually comes from her tummy and goes right out between her legs. So this is the birth of the sun from Virgo. And uh, it's a real lot of... Can this only happens about every 7,000 years. And although I, they say that, but then again, it happened 2,000 years ago, plus a few. And... Uh, Apparently, the last time it happened was this event, 3 BC, September 11th, and it's fixing to happen September 23rd of this year, which scares the hell out of me. Uh, 